Dylan Stan Commissioner Wenzel, um, they have been tremendous partners for us in Waterbury with many of the initiatives we've had with school reform. I also want to personally thank uh, Dr. Basso, President of the Connecticut Teacher of the Year Council and Council members. And I also want to acknowledge in the audience this evening some special people. We have our Honorable uh, Mayor O'Leary for the City of Waterbury. We have Waterbury Board of Education's commissioners with us, many staff and uh, family members there, uh, students as well. A special welcome to the Connecticut High School students, our uh, Kennedy Eagles are in the audience as well. So, very good. <laughs> Let me begin by saying that I wish to congratulate all of the District Teacher of the Year. I'd like to start off by noting that while tonight is most certainly about honoring your accomplishments as individuals, please be mindful that you also represent the enduring qualities that define the essence of all Connecticut's hardworking, dedicated, and caring teachers. You represent the hearts and minds, the hopes and dreams, and the legacy of every student who is so privileged to call you their teacher. You truly make a difference every single day. You change lives for the better every single day. I am truly humbled to speak with you tonight. Family members, friends, colleagues, take a good look at the person with whom you arrived tonight in order to honor. In no uncertain terms, we are among the best in the profession. Each of you brings honor to the teaching profession and has earned the respect of your community. Today, as the proud and honored Waterbury Superintendent of Schools, I have the distinct privilege of introducing the 2016 Connecticut Teacher of the Year. Mrs. Johanna Hayes is someone who not only teaches history, now she is making history. As the first Waterbury teacher to be named Connecticut Teacher of the Year in the 62-year history of this prestigious award, Johanna bestows an incredible honor on our district and our city. Johanna grew up in Waterbury, attended Waterbury Public Schools, and has returned to give back to her students all that was given to her. Johanna clearly has a storied history with the city of Waterbury. She grew up in poverty, yet saw in the reflection of her teacher's eyes the person she could become. The encouragement she received from her teachers sustained her on her long road to graduation, then to community college seven years after that, then to a four-year college, and then to the start of her teaching career. She in turn gives a glimpse of their possible futures to her students as she projects her belief that all of her students have potential and promise and that their only constraints are self-imposed. She demonstrates authentically that life is not about where you came from, but where, rather where you are going. Johanna's talents and contributions extend far beyond the walls of her classroom. In addition to teaching history at Jonathan F. K. N. A. Kennedy High School, including an advanced course in African American history for which she wrote the curriculum, she serves as the Kennedy High School Governance Council chairperson. She has been the NIES committee chairperson since 2007, as well as the NIES visiting committee member since 2010. Johanna heads the Students of Academic Renown 
an academic program at Kennedy High School, and also serves as the chair of that review board. She also serves as a faculty advisor for a number of students' clubs out and outside the classroom. Johanna supports students in all extracurricular activities and inspires students to follow her lead and become involved in community service. Her contributions do not solely lie within the geographic boundaries of our city or our state, as she works with Habitat for Humanity in several states and is proud to be a member of helping out people everywhere. As if this were not sufficient, Johanna collaborated with the district HR supervisor and grant writer to develop a successful grant project for a $25,000 planning grant to recruit minority staff to the district, which has recently been enhanced by the addition of $50,000 in home invitation award. Johanna continually advocates for the development and support of future teacher clubs for Waterbury High School students. When asked about her success, Johanna demurely says that she can readily relate to her students and that she sees herself in her mission in part as eliminating the concept of passive learning and as promoting more interest in process and product. I turn to those with whom she works to elicit thoughts so that my remarks today would not be solo, but rather a chorus of comments about Johanna's impact on the lives of those she touches. One comment by a Board of Education member was particularly striking in defining her selflessness, and I quote, in an interview, I heard her say I once, and we 35 times. She is full of life, and she wants to share that with you. She's a bubble. Administrative comments range from she can just flat out teach, to she's a galvanizer, to she's 200% of a human being. And legend states, and legend says, that she jumped into a dumpster to retrieve law student work. I believe that's true. <laughs> I really do. Colleagues say that she catches the freshmen, lures them in, attracts and keeps them so that absenteeism does not become a way of life. Parents tell us that kids simply adore her, and that students tell us that she's one of those teachers who gets you to look into the future. So as you can see, I wanted not a solo, but a chorus. And in asking about Johanna, I got a symphony. Waterbury is truly graced with this distinction this evening and for honoring her fellow colleagues here tonight and all the students in Connecticut. Again, I extend my congratulations and my gratitude to all the district teachers of the year in attendance this evening. It is to each of you that our society regularly entrusts that which is most precious to us, our children. I can see here today that the trust is well placed. And now, ladies and gentlemen, it gives me great pleasure to introduce to you the 2016 Connecticut Teacher of the Year, Ms. Johanna Hayes from Milwaukee.